My name's John. Uh, this is a video response to Zach George's question uh, in which he asks, why should we have not invaded Iraq? I would say in answer to that, uh, Zach, the answers to that question are clearly delineated and available if you choose to look for them. For example, in Peter Galbraith's excellent new book, The End of Iraq, and in many other sources, the idea that the Bush administration did not even take into consideration, even as a contingency, that the United States may not be greeted as liberators once we invaded, uh, that the idea of civil war was dismissed uh, or not even considered by the administration, uh, is evidence that this president does not have, to use your words, the spine to handle this job or the courage if one assumes that the courage to think that you may be wrong, or the ability to think you may be wrong is a sign of courage. This president doesn't have it. Um, you asked another question. Would a far left president, bleeding heart, to use your words, have done better? I don't know. Um, we didn't actually have that choice. John Kerry was not a, a, a far left guy, uh, in spite of what Rush Limbaugh says. He was actually pretty much a middle of the road uh, person who had some military experience, by the way. Uh, but would he have done better? I don't know. You know, it's hard to be a failed president. You have to really work hard to be a bad president. I think Gerald Ford proved that point. Just about anybody can take on that responsibility and do a decent job. This president, however, George Bush, has shown that just about anybody could have done better than he did. Um, so maybe you're asking the wrong question. Why should we not have invaded Iraq? Um, let's say those answers are readily available if you choose to look for them. But the idea that George Bush is the best of all possible presidents, or that he's done a great job, I don't know. I don't know where a person has to be to ask a question like that. But it certainly isn't. Uh, uh, it. I don't think that person is actually aware of what's going 